know it, I tried to get the interview mic on, I forgot there's a, uh, there's two baby seats in the back, so we didn't have time to take those things out. Although Christy, Christy could have fit in one of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're in Christy's car, um, which is, what is this? This is like a big SUV. It's a pilot. Yeah. Honda pilot. Honda pilot, nice. Um, and uh, we've got Al Jackson in the back. Um, yes. Um, so, <laughs> going through the stuff. Uh, this is like a rental car. There's nothing in here. Uh, <laughs> Why don't you have anything? There's no coins. Because I'm clean. Like, this, is very, <laughs> this is very strange. Okay, we are. I, uh, I was getting my car ready, and then I realized that we had the two baby seats. We have a. Uh, Chris Spangle is. Are we doing the uh, Facebook Live thing right now? Yes. Okay, he's in the back seat. I. I. I yeah, I would have been more comfortable driving, uh, Christy. You might want to apply the brakes. I'm just saying. As my, the momentum of my body as I hurtle toward the dashboard. Oh, I wanted to get there before the Christy, show was over. Christy can't hear you. Yes. Christy cannot hear you. No, go ahead. Really? I've, I've never driven with her. I have no idea. She's doing great. First of all, she, okay. her, her gas yeah. tank is completely filled up. Yes. Okay. That's a good now, sign. Al is, Al is trying to be nice. Look at this car. He's, this he's is saying a, the car is incredible. Is your house like this? Yeah. There is absolutely yeah, is, nothing in this car. Well, this looks like a spy's car. Is this, yeah. Al, Al, <laughs> Al just said it's like we rented it. <laughs> this car is immaculate. It's very, it's almost Do you let your girls in this car? <laughs> what do they do? They must be on the phone the whole time. She makes them put those booties on like when you're going into a delivery room. <laughs> no. Is this like when the service guy comes to your house and puts the little booties on in your car? And also, it's got a big console, what's this called, console, yes. in the middle. So absolutely no way you can have any kind of sexual encounter in the front two seats. Yeah, when did they start making, what happened to the bucket seats so we can make some of these babies? Out, oh, wait a minute. Oh, Christy says she, she dro that. drops the back seat down for a lot of action. <laughs> yeah, that's what Yeah, I'm she's saying. got a sleep number, uh, retractable <laughs> she, third she row. Sleep, a sleep number Honda. <laughs> sleep number third row. <laughs> um, we are on our way to do something very special. I'm really excited about this. Um, now, there's a slight issue here. I can't do it. <laughs> but, so get the girl and the black guy. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to sacrifice a blonde and a black guy. Half of the college brochure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Josh can do it. Well, we'll, may, well, maybe we can bring him by later. Um, we, we had a we had a news story about this. It's a, it's a something new in the world of um, fitness and uh, what's the word I'm looking for and recovery, and it involves it involves standing in an uh, uh, an ice cold chamber, <laughs> and I'm by ice cold I think it's like 160 below zero. Yeah. It's, it's whatever. It's super cold and um. The, it's called Green Bay. They, they've just uh, uh, put one in, and I had a chance to go observe this the other day, and I thought, what would be more fun than having Christy? Uh, and Al get in this thing, and uh, yeah, they can get in together. That's the beauty of oh, this. Oh, there we go. All right, there we go. Well, uh, body yeah, heat. Baby. It's like it's like a big shower, but it's a. I, I think it's 160 below zero. So uh, um, shrink it. No, no judgments. <laughs> <laughs> can we get it before? Yeah, we're not gonna, yeah, Al's a little concerned that we're going to be judging um, <clears throat> anatomical parts. Oh, um, gee. Right. Hang on, I'm sorry. Christy just hit a hit a sewage thing the size of the so... Grand Canyon. <laughs> we're crossing over the tracks. We're gonna go find Christy. Okay, well, now we're actually we're literally crossing railroad tracks. So, so we may be on uh, on the way to Christy's house. It's across the tracks. Oh. <laughs> uh, in any event, so we're, they're gonna get into the freezing chamber. Uh, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, now, again, I suppose they can. Yeah, now, and I should explain that this chamber is designed in such a way that if they want to get out, they can. They, they can just push the... Not door. like this a is, marriage. It, 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 it's, it's, <laughs> it, as Al said, it's not like a marriage. All you have to do is push the door and you're out. Yeah. <laughs> Although, that might be a very popular thing in a prenup. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if I push the shower door, you are out. <laughs> 
uh, this should be very exciting. Um, and um, yeah, I was going to do it, but I, I didn't have a chance to get a hold of my uh, doctor because I had a uh, giant piece of metal in my right arm from my motorcycle accident. Yeah, that wanna, might not be great. I don't want to get in this chamber and have that metal explode. Or That's how they stop so. Magneto and X Men. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah so you don't want to do that. Yeah, it's probably okay, but I, I couldn't get a hold of uh, my guy yesterday. Jesus, Jesus. <laughs> excuse me. Hello. Let me. Can I explain something, Christy? The double yellow lines are the ones you don't cross because of the yeah. oncoming traffic, the, yeah. the multi-ton <laughs> vehicles hurtling towards us at 50 miles an hour. You are such an extravagant. Wow. Extra okay. Ex no. What's the word? Okay, we have a red light, so we may be okay. <laughs> okay. Um, yes. Yeah, well, would you, you know that I almost never am in an automobile unless I'm driving. I know, that's what uh, makes this even better. I, uh... He hates this. Look makes at me, him. Makes me very look nervous. Look at him. because Chrissy's almost killed us in suburban traffic. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm a terrible backseat he driver. He hates to... No, uh, anytime. I, I pretty much insist on driving, but, uh... Okay, we're almost there. You can drive my car if you'd like. Uh, no, I don't know the controls. I have to. <laughs> I, the controls. I, 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 I would not know what to do. I, I, steering wheel and I, have, to, I have to drive my car. When you rent trouble. a car, do you have to rent the car you own? I hate renting cars. I, <laughs> I never know what to do. <laughs> Tom's getting to that age where he hates more than he likes yeah. things. I hate running cars. Yeah. yeah, I hate not driving. <laughs> it's well, this is great. Well, uh, among the other stupid things I've done, as I uh, one time hit a button in a, in a rental car uh, on a freeway and the convertible top started to go up. <laughs> it uh, it was uh, well, it, it, this was. <laughs> this was an older car, <laughs> and it did quite a bit of damage. Oh, wow. The uh, wind caught it? Yeah, the wind oh. caught it. It was very humorous. It wasn't my car, of course. I'd run it. In any event, let's just move forward here. <laughs> uh, so what the, the, uh, the, the, the team is going to get into this uh, freezing cold chamber, and we'll let you know how it goes up. And this, this apparently, I guess a lot of NFL teams use these, Chick. I think you're supposed to go for, like, a minimum of a minute, and two minutes. you're supposed two to try to go two, minutes. three, four minutes. But I know a chick. You'll, this will interest you because I know you're a big NFL guy. I guess these are really big in uh, sports medicine now. Christy, I'm not allowed to be this close yeah, to high it's school. Something about you, your uh, your <laughs> some uh, accusations. I'll, I'll find out. <laughs> Al's doing his own show back there. Sorry. <laughs> She was lying. We're going to find out. It's, it's, it's ice cold. Now, Al, do you like the cold? Uh, I do not like the cold. I think you know that. I live in California. I lived in Miami. I am a, yeah, Al lived in Miami I am a black man of particular. I need a certain temperature, and I don't like frost. I don't understand yeah. the cold. I don't understand. Why don't you just move? You can move. Uh, now, can you, you, you can be dressed in the chamber, apparently, yes. All right. Sort of. Is it I optional? Observed, I observed sort of. it yesterday. Right. Christy uh, <laughs> knows a little bit about it. Apparently, you can, uh, I guess you have to wear socks or something. Yes, and guys have to have their genitals covered. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being so Christy just that. said, guys have to have their genitals covered. I guess that's, that's Al. Al, that's so they don't, that's so they don't break off. <laughs> And also, Tom, yeah. I think that's just a general life rule. I think yeah. we always no. have to have our generals Josh covered. Wants, Josh wants to know, Al, apparently you're supposed to wear socks. Josh wants to know if you have three socks. <laughs> <laughs> so you can do you can do a red hot chili what? pepper thing. Have you ever seen that thing where they just get on stage with just the socks? Yeah, it, I'm going to have just fun. an elephant trunk uh, over it. We are um, <laughs> we're in a little bit of traffic. Yeah. What if this because segment... Because I'm... Oh, God. <laughs> no, we're we're no. I'm sorry. We're we're on some kind of uh, special line, so I I'm the only one that can hear you. So I'm just relaying what you say to everybody. Um, <laughs> traffic update. Uh, Jeezel. Okay, okay. Well, you, if you want to break, that's okay. We're we're probably a few minutes away from getting there, and I really have to go to the bathroom. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, see if it freezes before it hits the ground. This is as close as, as uh, far yeah. as you can get to Compton. Yeah, yeah. Right right here. How I got ironic. a feeling once you get into 160 <laughs> below, it'll be hard to get anything moving. Um, <laughs> by the way, we are actually uh, on a street called Compton. Um, judging by the automobiles 
and the people walking around, it's not the one made famous in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to see this ice cube come walking out of his house. It's like, oh, you guys, you guys fell for that? It's the real Compton. <laughs> no P.F. Chang's around. This is a, I, I wonder how the signal is because it's, I can, I mean, I can hear them perfectly. Are we on break? Yeah, we're on a break. We're still on Facebook Live. Oh. Get off your phone and move! There we go. Well, road rage I have with really bad road rage. Do you really? Yes, do you I yell do. at people? Yes. All right, well, don't go back. Say what, say what you would normally say. And people are idiots. Would you, you just have to be very careful to flip people off. I don't flip anybody off. I keep it all to myself. But, oh, my goodness, it can get bad. I don't understand why. It, can you not flip people off? Because I feel like it's an arbitrary thing that we've made up. It's not a real thing. Well, I don't want them to know that yeah, I'm And you get this... people pulling up next to you and... Them to think that I'm slamming on the brakes. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, slamming in the brakes. Yeah. And... I'm not kidding. I have a real problem. I do have a real problem with road rage, and I don't know where it comes from. Because I'm generally a pretty nice person. But I think that's why it is. When you're in a car, though, you're by yourself. By myself. You're in this little world yeah. that you are. You're yeah. the king of. And I always of. tell the girls, I go, don't, don't be doing this. This is just. Just get frustrated. What I say. Don't yeah. do what I've showed you over yeah. the course of 18 years. I used to live right down the street. I think we could stop. I can use the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Are you familiar with the Bob and Tom show? Oh. It's yeah. good for you. Hold it. We had a great story once. Uh, Sammy Hagar was on our show, and he was. Uh, I think he was. I think it was uh, Myrtle Beach, maybe, or uh, somewhere in that area. He was on one of the Atlantic beaches. He really had to go to the bathroom. And they'd been on some long walk or whatever, and he climbed up somebody's beach to beach house and knocked on the door and said, Hi. <laughs> and they went, Are you Sammy Hager? <laughs> yes. Hey, listen, could I use your bathroom? <laughs> you know, one of the that'd be one of the few really cool perks about being famous. Yeah. And he is, by the way, the nicest guy. Is ever. he really? That's I, I heard he uh, tried to make amends with Van Halen. Yeah, he's recently. A, he's a super that's awesome. I did that once in a golf outing. I didn't. I had to go so bad. And you know how they have houses all along the golf course? And this lady was just sitting out on her back patio, and I go, I hate to bother you, but I really have to use the restroom. Christy, that's called white privilege. <laughs> <laughs> I, could, I could never do that. Yeah. Excuse yeah. me. I'd be face down in a puddle of urine. <laughs> well, I don't need to go anymore, so we're fine. Thank you. <laughs> the cops tased it out of me. <laughs> That's beautiful. And I do love you, Mom. Okay, now we, I think what we should do is when we get there, we'll talk to him for a while, and at the 20 break, we'll do it. Okay. And we're going to... and. Um, I think that uh, yeah, that clock's way fast. We will have a special guest joining us. All right. Okay. Are we still in Facebook Live? That clock live? is way yeah. early. Yeah. I know. I can, every time I change it, it way, way later. I don't know. That's it's, a, is that not automatically sync up to a satellite? No, I don't think so. What year is this? You program your own. Twenty thirteen. I. Jeez. Yeah, it's just weird when you have to you program know, it. I'm, Kind of poor person, yeah. Are you? yeah. <laughs> what poor. an uppity statement that was. <laughs> right turn, right turn. Yeah. I'm turning right. <laughs> I know where I'm going, dick face. <laughs> What's that guy doing? <laughs> Can I just always okay. be in the car with you? Can we make sure. that some kind of rule? <laughs> Mr. Al. <laughs> <laughs> slow down now, slow down. <laughs> I gotta make water. Tom's gotta make water. <laughs> oh, my life would be so much funnier if I had you in the car all the time. That's for sure. Maybe I wouldn't yell at people. Yeah, that's the thing. Have you seen our little electric cars you can rent? <laughs> and why is he? TJ Miller. I know, he's yeah. tonight at the Vogue. Is that cracker still open? Yeah. Yeah, it's right there. Right next door. Okay, it's... Oh, what's that? That is a big eyesore. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. We're on Facebook. You guys are very, uh... <laughs> sorry. Get off my lawn over here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm old school. I, I'm an old school 
incredible girl, and that just breaks my heart. I'm sorry. What would you rather see there? Nothing. A, a park? I don't know, but not that. Not high rise. There's my bank. We like to get some money. All right. What's okay. your pin? And I had a lovely lunch over here yesterday. Yes, in the kitchenette, I'm sure. True fitness. We are here. We are here. Her license plate says Tri Cryo. Oh, no. Hey, uh, can you pop the trunk for me? Please? Yeah, sure can. Right. It's automatic. Look at this. <laughs> this is really big, Kristen. This is so, like literally, I love this. Sorry about this. Just web director stuff. Walked in. Um, I've got a big surprise for you. Um, uh, when I walked in here, uh, Donnie Baker is uh, lifting weights in the other room. Uh, yeah, we're we're at a place called True Fitness, and I'm standing in the room with the uh, cryotherapy refrigeration unit. We're going to have uh, Christy Lee and uh, and Al Jackson get into in just a second. They're in the other room. We got to uh, get. Uh, Again, this thing is like minus 160. Let me see if I can get someone from. Can we get someone? Over? Is Elizabeth over there? Can I talk to her? Um, where, where, where's Christine Al? Are they getting they're, un they're, undressed? They're talking with Donnie in the other room. We, uh, Donnie Baker is here, uh, apparently get, getting a workout of some sort. Uh, I'm not surprised though, because there are a lot of uh, very pretty, pretty ladies here. Uh, Al, come on in. We have uh, comedian Al Jackson has joined us. You may know Al from the BBC. Well, is he dressed or? Uh, no, he's wearing street clothes. Yeah. <laughs> street and, clothes. Uh, All right. We have uh, we have Elizabeth has joined us. Uh, she's uh, one of the ladies that works here, and we're in front of the chamber. Um, it's the uh, it's the uh, cryotherapy chamber. How cold is it in there, Elizabeth? Uh, about negative 145 degrees Fahrenheit. Wow. Negative 145. All right. Yeah, okay. Pretty cold. And uh, have you done this? Oh yes, many times. Okay. Now there was some concern, and forgive me for the frankness of my language. Christy was concerned that her nipples might freeze and fall off. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. There we go. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, that won't happen. Hillbilly <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say, Donnie? I couldn't hear you. What'd you I say? Said if Christy's nipples freeze off, those are called hillbilly gummy bears. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> well, this is great that Donnie's there. Donnie's That's here. Great. This is very exciting. Donnie has his Zubas on. So, Elizabeth, sure. what's the the idea? Is you get into this freezing cold chamber, and it looks like a big shower. 
Um, you could hold two people in there, right? Yeah, two okay. people can go in. Two We've pe- had three in before, too. Really? Yeah. Okay. And it then, gets a little crowded with three. And the notion is uh, you're, you get in, your body gets incredibly cold pretty quickly. Right, right, very quickly. And then, right. what, and then the, what's the idea? that as, as you warm up, it heals you or something? Yeah, what happens is you step in the chamber, and your um, skin temperature drops rapidly. So all the blood goes from your extremities to your core. Right. And then <clears throat> stays there until you get out. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Once it's Excuse in your me. core, it's Pardon enriched me. with oxygen what the hell nutrients. Was that? And I was moving. I don't know. He moved my. Uh, I was moving Elizabeth's mic. <laughs> she, that, that, that was not. That was not some kind of gaseous emission. <laughs> <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> well, that's what it sounded like. Sorry. I'm sorry. So Elizabeth is explaining the principle behind this. And right. these are, I know there's a lot, NFL teams have a right. lot of these things. And yeah. the idea, is this kind of like icing your arm after yeah, pitching? Yeah, it's like icing, but it's better, it's more effective, and okay. it's quicker. Now, Christy's really kind of frightened about doing this. Oh, don't be, don't be too frightened. Isn't this what Walt Disney did? Well, I did. I did notice when I walked in. When I walked in, there was a picture of there was a picture of Ted Williams. (laughs) Frightened me. It's like Demolition Man. No, that's that's called cryogenic freezing, where they freeze bodies. I think they're going to try to bring him back to life one day or something. This is different than cryogenic freezing. Well, this is like it it depends exactly what it is. If you stay in there. If you stay in there for the whole break. Oh okay. uh, yeah, you don't want to, you don't want to yeah. stay in there for more than well, well, we won't put you in for more than three minutes. Okay. Are we going to say how? Now, no now a lot of the NFL players and the people that are really lean with less body fat, they'll they'll go in for longer, like maybe even four she's minutes. She's talking about all of us. Wow. Like, oh, oh the, yeah, okay. the athletes. <laughs> Now, but and I should explain it, it again. It's like a shower. It's not like you're going to feel trapped. It's like a shower. Is and there a glass door? Yeah, there's a glass door. Mm-hmm. Um, so how long is how long is lethal, Tom? Is it over four minutes? Well, I don't think you're supposed to stay in. It. That's the whole idea. Well, well yeah, but you don't want to stay in there a long time. I mean, this would be the, if it, let's I'm just curious. Say, I mean, uh, if you well, walked I think outside we and push the envelope. No, there's Ooh. no no. <laughs> now, um, I, I just want to see how. And it's been my understanding that you feel very refreshed. Yes. After doing this, now, ordinarily I'd be the first one in. Except, <laughs> except I have a I have a bunch of metal in my arm from a motorcycle accident, so oh, I'm not sure I can go in. Fine. She told well, yeah, I have, I, I, excuse I have to talk to a physician. Why don't you be quiet and not argue? With me. <laughs> That's it. His okay. doctor said he couldn't do it. Uh, <laughs> no, I haven't. T- I tried to get a hold of him yesterday, but Next I didn't dial. Right, yeah. um, <laughs> so uh, now, what do they wear when they get in the chamber? Um, well, some. <laughs> Some as people go as naked, possible. but yeah. Christy, we won't make you go naked. <laughs> no, uh, just like really right. short shorts and like a sports bra. You That's have to what I, I have short shorts about, and a sports now, bra. I was told okay. by somebody that and when a, when a man goes in, he is supposed to wear some kind of. Um, he has to cover his genitals. Cover right, his genitals. right. Yeah, a man can't ah. go naked. A woman. Why can't, can't a man go naked? Well, there's stuff you don't want to freeze. <laughs> oh, well, that. And you, you don't want to see how quickly your testicles <laughs> yeah. shoot up into your abdomen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, and Al, I would imagine, as Josh was saying, I, the, your testicles probably <laughs> shoot up inside your abdomen. <laughs> it's, it's 145 well, I want below to see zero. That. Yeah. Wow, wow. Now, um, we, uh, I think we'll try to do, should we try to do one solo and then maybe. Who would you let? Do you want to go in there with uh, Donnie, Christy? What? Yes. Are you out of your friggin' mind? <laughs> well, hey, let's, let's make a little Eskimo baby this time. <laughs> is there, your is there a maximum? Would not even be seen. What do you Is there a maximum on when? You heard the lady. She said the blood runs from your extremities to your pork, so <laughs> <laughs> you'll have something to sit on in there. Core, core, she said core, not Ch- pork, Chick Donnie. has a question. What can, the, can, can Christy go in more than one time? Or no. Is it, Oh, just well, one. yeah, That's you, a good can question. Go in, you can go in more than one time a day. No, I'm not going in okay. Oh, you're not. <laughs> so so <laughs> now Elizabeth is our spokesperson um, at True Fitness, and we're standing in front of the uh, cryotherapy chamber. Mm-hmm. And this is being Facebook Live uh, uh, right now? Yeah, oh, I, awesome. I, yeah, Mr. Spangle is putting this thing on Facebook Live. Right, so you can catch it on and there. And it's, uh, it's my understanding that when testing this yesterday, uh, Spangle, uh, Mr. Spangle from our staff actually did this. Yeah. Okay, and your, your genitalia remains pictures. intact. His nipples are still hard from it. <laughs> Oh. You, you do have rather uh, protuberant nip, protru- protruding nipples. I, oh That's boy. what I'm afraid of. Why? No, don't be afraid, Christy. Just let, <laughs> let, let whatever happens happen. in your ear. <laughs> so typically, d- now, uh, your clientele, I know you just opened. It's a brand new thing. So your, is your clientele mostly ladies? Um, yeah, we have well, a lot of ladies, but we have men, too. A lot okay. of athletes. I mean, it's really kind of a wide range so of people. Do the, but do the guys usually go in naked except do they wear underwear? Yeah, they wear, like, a lot of times they'll wear boxer shorts. Okay. But the rest is, But do you have yeah. to, do they have to have an, underneath the boxers? Do they have some kind um, of, like, a thermal pouch? No, no. Not really. <laughs> okay. Now, when, you, when, you, when, when, you, when they brought this machine in, did the, the people, the manufacturer or the, whoever was there, did they 
is there some kind of weird accoutrement that they give you for like glasses or headgear or booties oh or, to wear in there yeah well, yeah there's certain things you have to wear but they don't have like a special groin device no no he, he wants to, <laughs> not yeah. that i he know he wants of. to know what goes on the balls all right just here's yes. what i'm trying to i'm trying to make these ladies some extra money here's uh, what you're gonna very, do very important. you guys design some kind of crotch thing for oh, this because this is taking off all across the country yeah it is. in like the world of sports fitness you guys could design something that would be very specific with your logo oh, yeah. on it Oh yeah, and then start a, selling it, selling it nationally. I love cryo. We have a logo that says cryo is a long cryo. word, Tom. He might not be able to read it all. Are you suggesting that if, if you could only read the whole thing if it were on your groin? <laughs> no, <laughs> not cryo therapy on yours. Are That's we, really are we going with? Yeah. Is this the old stereotypical joke where you've never rolled the condom all the way down? <laughs> That's exactly what it was. So they didn't. They didn't seriously have some kind of um, like a pouch or something. You put down there no okay no. But, but it is important to wear protection yes. in the groin yeah. area okay you, yeah. please stop touching your naked. groin when you're done. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you keep doing I'm, I'm, I'm demonstrating okay we once again Karen is the owner of the establishment karen okay hi karen the, oh okay but the good news can. is that women can go naked but boys cannot cannot okay you have to protect yours so that's good news we, for what for us we is can we're go observing in there right like <laughs> okay you know right like we are okay well good and now do okay, a lot of the ladies do it naked no, but some do. Okay, do we have to take a break? I assume. Yeah, we have to take a break before they go in, so we'll be okay, back. We'll, with that. we'll, we'll get them ready to go in okay. the uh, the uh, cryotherapy recovery chamber. When did the naked uh, ladies get? One hundred and forty five. One hundred and forty five degrees. Is that what you said? Uh, negative one hundred and forty five. I'm sorry. Yo, yo. Because yeah. one hundred and forty five. Then you'd be. Then, <laughs> then you'd, you'd be, be toast. You'd be broiling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the very opposite of really cold. How, how long would that take? Before? <laughs> uh, this portion of the Bob and Tom Show is actually. Yeah. I ain't afraid of this. I'll go in there right now. I swear to God. The only thing is, if the last one out can. Take care of Wiffy. I don't have a living will, and I will not give up full custody. She's taking them off and they're up by her ears, so this is a new position for her. for Tush and this for Bush. So I've got double coverage. So I've got a couple different ones here. I got to Angel Skinner's I don't talk to anymore. But Teresa Reynolds is a new one. We call her the throw red because she's flat and dirty and you can lay her down anywhere. So I don't see this one lasting. No, 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 no. I'm not talking. I can't. I don't know. You have Huh? You have Donnie will talk. But Donnie, go. All right. Because I can't. I don't think I can. I don't think I can talk. I'm not kidding. You're, you're very afraid of this, aren't you? I'm very afraid of this. I don't want to do this. It's going to be fun. Building is going to be fun. Do you want to bring a hat? This is a friend. You're going to wear a hat or you wear that? I'm going to get her a hat. No, no, no. Are we still Facebooking live? Yeah. 
We got you. We got you changing and everything. You can't go in like that. Which one? You gotta take your shoes off. I gotta take my shoes off? Oh, yeah. You gotta take your shoes off and get socks on. Okay, well, take shoes off. Did you get a chance to, uh, are you still doing that? Yeah. Oh, did you get a chance to listen to that? <laughs> you gotta strip down a little more than that, my friend. Can you go in? Well, it's, it's not recommended because you won't get all the benefits. You want to have to strip down. Wait a minute, this is so funny. We're going to do this on the air? Yeah, some of this I want to do on the air. We're on. Can we do some of this on the air? You're not going to get the benefit. We have to fill 20 minutes, so it would be nice to do some of this on the air. Christian, can you go back and remember? I'll just stay here. Do I have a mobile? Uh, I'm going to kind of interview Chrissy like she's changing in there. Right. Yes, Chrissy? Everybody's very pro nip on Facebook. Everyone's very pro nip on Facebook. It's weird. Yeah. <laughs> Let the nips go. Yeah, I'm already getting a little nipply. I, yeah, it's hard. Man. Can I, can I do this on Facebook, Bob? Oh, hell yeah. 75 degrees in here. Yeah. So, I think it's 75. I got a meme like this. Oh, it's fine. I'm just stay out here. I'm just stay out here. South Park and the Cable Company. <laughs> This is great. Eddie, the hardest working man in radio. Eddie makes sure that the uh, broadcast goes well. He can't go in. He can't go in because he's got wet hair. Uh, okay. He has wet hair. He can't go. Who has wet hair? I you want to, so do you Al want to go with go. Al? Yeah, Al should. Al go. Then Donnie can do the play-by-play with me. So fuck you. We're doing Al. Get Al ready. How'd you get wet hair, Donnie? Yeah. I took a horse bath in the men's room. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I know it'll be funny if you get ready. Okay. It'll be funny if you get ready um, on the airway. We're going to try to do this 20 minutes. It'd be good to get a couple of people. Do yeah, you can't go right because your ears are wet. Yeah, I can drive you. Ready for a dummy? Well, you and me, Al. Yeah, yeah. He's driving. Some people do it from a lot of Probably just for two or two and a half minutes because. Chrissy, it's going to get great. She's in the bathroom ready. She's in the bathroom ready. She's in the bathroom ready. Hey, I love Place called True Fitness, and um, we're here because uh, they have um, one of the first cryotherapy recovery chambers. And this is uh, something.
So it's a brand new thing, and um, uh, uh, we are going to have. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I, 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 this is radio. I, I, uh, Christy has been getting ready in the next one. Let me walk over here. Uh, I'm going to have to describe this because uh, Christy's ready to go into the chamber. She's wearing a black, um, how would you call it? A black wool hat. Well, she is on. Uh, uh, no, yeah, for sure. Football fight in Jamaica. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and also the, what I was the reason I was laughing is you also have on a um, a medical mask over your face. Yes, I have to wear the mask in there, so you don't want to breathe in the really cold air because it'll oh, freeze sure. your nasal passages. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> no. And uh, also, we also have Donnie Baker here uh, as an observer. Donnie was here lifting weights. Hi, Donnie. It's the first time I've ever seen my baby's mama wearing a romper, and let me tell you, it's working. <laughs> <laughs> Donnie, of course, the father of Little Wolfie. Uh, yes. The uh, the brand new uh, child that uh, Christy Lee has also with us uh, in the uh, in the studio here um, uh, the uh, the cryo therapy studio it's comedian Al Jackson yeah I love it now it's my understanding that we're gonna send both Al and Christy in together into the chambers that are right? we the first interracial couple in the crowd um, yeah actually I think we're so breaking down all the <laughs> barriers here oh. we're doing it <laughs> I bet, it's okay I was gonna say I bet Obama's so. America yeah. Al it's okay it's okay in this county. <laughs> Now, if we were to move over that way yeah. or that way, there might be there might be someone at the door. <laughs> Picket lines tomorrow. Now, um, so let's, uh, Elizabeth, what is Al? Now, Al currently is dressed in his street clothes. What does he have to do here? Um, he needs to put on shorts, and you need to take off your shirt. All right, I have a boxer briefs <laughs> on. That's good. That's, that's fine. fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, so he's got, to take, he's got to take his shoes off? Yes. Yeah, right. he needs to take his shoes well, off you can and go, put on some socks. Okay. Uh, All right. So does he leave his, he takes his shirt off. Right. Now, why does he do that? Uh, because you want to expose the most skin as possible and get yeah. the best benefits awesome. okay did well, you hear it that sounds like it's christy not just has, so we can look at him it, it <laughs> sounds like christy has more clothes on and now has she, less clothes she, on yeah. i do yeah. because i am not going in there with just a sports bra and volleyball once again christy on. has a huge winter cap happening. on now you don't have your glasses on no i don't so i assume you're not supposed to wear your glasses in there elizabeth well, well it freeze to your face there, yeah. <laughs> yeah thanks Jake. So you, it's best yeah. not to wear yours. okay now uh just so you know it's it's actually warmer on mars than it is in that chamber josh you're yes. not helping. So it's 145 <laughs> below zero. Well, I don't think Christy's and, uh, really getting the. Uh, you know, Josh, whole, you owe uh, me because this would be you had I the, not stepped up. This okay. Doesn't, this doesn't seem like Christy's getting the whole experience being so dressed. I don't right, understand. Right, right. Uh, I am not taking my clothes <laughs> off. <laughs> now saying, we're putting you know, this on Facebook the Live as we speak. And, uh, yes. the, the shorts. I don't get the mittens and the wool hat. I, yes. mean, I think I, can, I look cute, like a little ski bunny. You do. I'm sure you do. Yeah. Now, so you have to wear socks so what your your feet don't freeze to the floor. And the gloves and the socks are so that your your core. So again, and again, the, it does get cold in there. The principle of this. Yeah, it's 140 <laughs> below zero. Yes. Yeah, it's that's actually. You don't want your fingertips cold, cold in your toes. For you? yeah. <laughs> the coldest, the coldest recorded temperature on Earth, negative 128. Oh, so, this will be, wow. so there you go. Yeah. Now, uh, Elizabeth, one more time. The idea of this is because this is being used by NFL teams, et cetera, mm -hmm. et cetera. The notion of. Well, all the blood rushes to your core, and um, and I faint. It, <laughs> it gets enriched Gosh, with I oxygen so. and nutrients, and, and it releases endorphins, norepinephrine. So when that blood rushes back out to your extremities after you get out, that's when the healing process takes place. Okay, okay. so um, and it does a, a lot so of different anyway, things. I, that's my understanding. You're going to come out feeling really refreshed, right. and then I'm going to kill you. Um, <laughs> I, I Do you have a, a ruler there to measure certain things on Stop Christy at right now? Okay. <laughs> Is it, I tried to find the thickest sports bra I could get. Christy, to. what about Al? We need to measure <laughs> stuff on Al. Oh. Okay, Al is oh, in, Al is in the next room. Okay. Al's, Al's, this is, this is a what? dream for Al. This is a Al's dream almost for me. naked and there are four blonde women here. And we're all uh. drooling over him. I think he might heat up the chamber enough for me to be able to handle this. Woo! Al, you're nice, looking good. Al, yeah. Al got uh, yeah. kind of a kind of a six pack ish Darn thing going on there. Yeah. And again, you can see all this on Facebook Live through the Bob and Tom. Al's app. about to emerge from Very the good, uh, dressing Josh. area. You look good, Al. Don't worry about it. Um, oh, yeah. Now he's wearing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> All right. 
Okay, I'm now ready to go. let me explain this. We have a we have a six we have a, and ivory. We have a six foot two black man yeah. wearing a headband, a small pair of shorts with a medical mask over his face. <laughs> this looks else. like this is the worst robbery I've ever been to. <laughs> The idea is they can't identify you, Shane. Oh, That's right. Oh, I, get, yes. I get it. Now, uh, this does look like a scene uh, <laughs> <laughs> from Pulp Fiction. Um, uh, once again, uh, Al is wearing oh, Al is wearing a pair of uh, boxer briefs, you've, and you've rolled the legs up. Is that correct? No, this is how it That's how they roll. That's how, That's how, how, how they roll. roll. Okay. 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 All right. And then uh, now Al has socks on and. Uh, what, a little flip flop. I look like somebody broke into my house, and like this is just how I was when they when I heard the glass break. <laughs> okay. You um, were uh, working on your counterfeiting. Is yeah. what it looks like. I bet. Yeah. Okay. And then he has a, uh, a North Face uh, headband on, covering his. A lot ears. of product placement Good. on me right now. Right. Okay. Nike North Face. Okay. You know, and Y. You know. Yeah. This is how real men go. And there you go. Okay. Stripped so down. men go stripped down. This okay. is how real men go. Yeah. Okay. And then now, um, once again, we are in front of the uh, cryotherapy. Recovery chamber oh. minus 145 in there, and room for two. Wow. Uh, now, so I'm sorry. When they go in, can we see th- see what they're up to? Well, yeah. There's a well, glass door. Well, for a door. minute, it fogs way up, and yeah. you can't see inside. That's when I'm going to make my move. That <laughs> <laughs> yeah. a boy. We call, we call that the sweet touch, spot. I think if you touch me, we'd stick together forever. I think you might want to yeah. rethink that. That's well, what I said. Uh, <laughs> I'm a little I'm a little concerned because I think the anxiety and the anticipation. <laughs> Al's genitalia is already in the retreat mode. Oh my gosh. Chris, they, my genitalia is always here for you. Thank you, Al. I yeah, appreciate it. Going You're going to need a blowtorch to get, to, to get access, I think. Okay, so now, Elizabeth, when they go in there uh, and we shut the door, and, and, and by the way, the door doesn't lock, so it's not like you're getting an MRI and you feel trapped. Uh, it, yeah, it's, I'm going to come out. It's in 140 seconds. minus 145, right, obviously right away, mm-hmm. and yeah. then then the how it steams up. What because of their body heat? Um, yes. Yeah, and then I think just that you letting the human okay. air into the door. Okay. So that kind of, but it, it will calm down. It doesn't. It doesn't. Humid. I think she said oh, not humid. Humid. Oh, okay. humid. So then, how yeah. long? How long do people typically go in for their on their first go around? Uh, first time about two and a half minutes. Okay. Now Karen is taking your body temperature. What's Al's body? Uh, his surface. Eighty-eight is the skin temperature. Eighty-eight is skin temperature. Okay. okay. Take Christie's okay. now. Will it, is it likely to be the same? And you want your skin temperature to drop thirty okay. percent. Oh boy, we're a match made in heaven, aren't we? Now, are we going to be able to take a microphone into the chamber? Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. We are. Oh wow! Yeah. I didn't. I didn't know mics could do. How can you? Okay. Uh, uh, no. How can you hold on to a mic in there? Okay. Did you want? That's your job. If you're going to give instructions, come something. over here and do it into the microphone. <laughs> uh, once, once again, we're about to send wanna, Al Jackson and Christy Lee into a minus 145 degree room. I just want to live. I'm not holding a microphone. You're going to okay. feel better. Okay. I'm getting, yeah. yeah Karen, well, Christy, you're going to love this. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Christy's uh, getting a little bit anxious. A little bit. I'm, I'm been sorry. Anxious I, I would have been happy to do this. Yeah. Except I have a medical condition <laughs> that precludes me from doing it. Donnie, do you want to grab the mic for the play-by-play? Me too. Play? I'm held together with chicken wire. We um, all know Donnie it. Baker is also here with us. Donnie! So. Hey, Donnie. This is just one of my fantasies come true, seeing my baby's mama next to somebody as big and brawny. And, is, uh, is out. Uh, how do you spell cut code, Josh? Can you Google that for me? <laughs> cut code. C-U-C-K-O-L-D. I think yeah. I may register. Yeah, this is uh, this is kind of like a weird scene from Mod Squad. Uh, we've got we've got one black, one blonde, and Donnie. <laughs> Kelly, if you're listening, you owe me big. Okay, time. now um, we are going. Now, when these guys get in the chamber, it starts right away, right? Yeah. And it, okay, and then there's a big t- uh, timer on a TV set right there. Once again, the chamber minus 145 degrees. Al Jackson. Christy Lee about to go inside. They're walking. And then if they want to, if they want to get out, if, if they want to get out, do they just tap on the door or just push it open? Just wait till our face hits the. They just push it open. <laughs> open it. Okay. If one wants to stay longer, you can. I'll, I'll probably stay in there. Okay. The over under is 30, 30 seconds back here in the studio. We're all okay. betting. All right. Those are no, good odds, Chick. I like that one. Yeah. They're getting they're getting their instructions now. Okay. okay. Something about. Sounds like they're going up in the Gemini okay. space capsule. Well, they say for the mail, I heard that, that you, 
things will freeze. I mean, I got sperm eggs the size of tadpoles. That'd be like passing a kidney stone after 30 seconds. I know, right? Yes. Sure. <laughs> that'd, be hor- that'd be horribly okay. painful. Okay, they're getting they're getting their instructions okay. now. So all right. Uh, once Good. again, Al. We're all here Jackson to support wearing nothing. To sign these forms. <laughs> yeah, sounds like a zip line at a flea okay. market. <laughs> yeah, it sure does. <laughs> sounds like a... The uh, parasail in the Bahamas is what it's <laughs> like. Got it, okay, they're going in, and, and Al does have a microphone. And go ahead, open the door. Okay. Well, oh, and oh, it's uh, steaming up. Holy Jesus! It's steaming up. Okay. Uh, oh, it looks like a sci-fi movie. It moving. All we can see is steam. <laughs> okay, we're doing good. We're dancing. Oh, we're doing like good, Christy. 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 Oh my goodness! They're this dancing. Is freezing cold. Okay. Can you hear me, Al? Yes, Tom. How are you? Good. I just, it's weird. It's like a mime thing. I see white gloves moving around. When is the cash going to come out of this thing? (laughs) It's like they're in the cash closet. Yes. Uh, Uh, Five seconds. Okay. Can Christy hear me? Okay. Uh, All right. She can't. Al. Yes. Ask Christy how she feels. Christy, how do you feel? <laughs> She's fine, don't believe her. Christy, okay. you're not doing your. How long have they been in? 41 seconds. 41 they, seconds, you can do it. They've been in there for 41 seconds. My nipples are freezing. Um, you'll remember this is how they put Han Solo down in the second Star Wars. That's true. He was frozen in carbonite. Yes, yes they, they froze Han Solo in carbonite. I'm kind of adjusting that. No, Al says he's adjusting. Okay, Christy's, Christy's getting out. out. Christy's Sounds out. like an accident and affair. She's right. out. Okay, now, how long did Christy get, last? Get her skin temperature. Now it's time for me to just get Can intimate with myself. Get Christy's skin temperature. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get too uh, okay. You don't want to snap anything I feel like off. this is like the Chronicles of Narnia in here. Al's I doing know, great. Right? Al's been in there a minute 18. Hey, Al, uh, yes, be careful. Sir. I left some deer meat in the back corner. I don't want you <laughs> stepping on it. Well, why is it in here? You need to cook it up. Let's get it going. Let's get the barbecue going. It's not bow season yet. You got a black man in town. Let's get the barbecue going. Okay, Al, how does it feel now? Uh, it feels cold. It's like a, a lot of relationships I've had in my life. <laughs> White women walking out on me. You know, it's funny, Al. It looks like you're doing your stand-up because you're holding a mic. Except you've got the medical mask over your face, <laughs> and you're this not is the dressed. Worst gig. This is the worst gig ever. <laughs> I, first of all, Donnie knows we've done gigs way worse than this. Well, and he's already walked one, yeah. been on stage two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a black duck stand, huh? We, we, we've got this on, on uh, Facebook Live. Yeah. He's at two minutes. Now. Al, try doing a joke. All right. Uh, glad all you guys can be here. Uh, <laughs> uh, what do you call a black man in a cryogenic chamber? What? The only one that is ever going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I've been at Morty's all week. Uh, two minutes and 30 seconds. Now, is it. it time to come out? Okay. All Nicely right. done. Thank you, guys. Okay, wow. get his, now get his skin temperature. Al Jackson. 54. 54. Ooh. It went from 88 Ooh. to 54. And now, wow. uh, Elizabeth, what's a typical uh, person coming out of that? What's the temperature often? Like? Um, they, we want them to drop at least 30 degrees. Okay, because I was now, here. they don't stay in there a long time. I was here like yesterday, and somebody came out, and they were 45. Well, oh, not yeah, that I was yeah. hog checking, but he went from nine and a half to three real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just in here like, I still got three? Hog check, hog check. I now, feel great. How do you feel? You feel Good. I feel refreshed. Feel refreshed? Yeah. I feel like know, a, well, maybe walk next door, get yourself some nice organic juice. How does Christy feel? Christy, you know, how do you feel? I, I feel much better now. Okay. I'm, I'm just really? a little freaked out. My claustrophobia is bad. I, I forgot in, about I that part. So it wasn't just Al being in there with you? Oh, no. no. Well, that was a good thing. But, oh, no, it yes. was. Uh, and I'm really disappointed. My nipples didn't get hard then. That's ex- terrible. That's oh. terrible. We're just, I'm just letting that soak in. <laughs> <laughs> I really expected it to be instant, like a huh. you know turkey thermometer on a turkey. Well, if you didn't, have well, maybe go counterclockwise way, yeah. next time. Oh, okay, <laughs> is that it? <laughs> yeah, you, you have so, your sports how does it feel yeah. com- compared to being, say, at a at an outdoor football game in in the, in late December? Well, seriously, I'm a skier, and I, I really didn't get that. I mean, I obviously I was not in there about a minute, but um, it wasn't as bad. So as, you were just you were just having a claustrophobia. I was issue. having more of a claustrophobia. But it's a glass issue. door; you could see I out know, here. It doesn't matter. It was still, yeah, it was okay. a little. And this uh, this it's the size of you could fit. You just had three people in. There. Oh, easy. Yeah. Once again, we're talking about the. Uh, the cryotherapy chamber 
Once again, apparently these are all over the NFL and uh, Major League Baseball now. And when you first walk in, I, I will say it's not as cold as I thought it would be. I mean... Minus 145? I know. It sounds really bad in your head, but seriously, when we were first in there, I mean, it wasn't as cold as I thought it would be. Seriously. As soon as I got in there, I was about to get out. It was so cold. Really? I got better. Like as soon It sounds as like a lot of your relationships. Yes. <laughs> oh, see, I was the opposite. Mine was just the claustrophobia, not necessarily the cold. Oh, not your relationships. What relationship? Are we going there? Come oh, on, leave me alone. He brought it up. Okay. Uh, um, wow. Al, your thoughts? Uh, I, I recommend this to anybody. And honestly, this is a black dude talking, so imagine how white people must feel. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to love it. Wow, I, I, this is great. I'm not Catholic, but I had a religious experience. So much white smoke when you opened the door, I thought we had the first black pope elected. <laughs> uh, Donnie Baker, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and wow. Well, well, thanks, Al. You did a great job. This is, this is good. So now tell me, uh, so now what's happening, Elizabeth, to their bodies? They're, they're coming back to their normal temperature, and the, the idea is that their blood is all circulating and healing, right. healing them yeah. up. Yeah, it heals joint pain, muscle pain. So this is kind of like a, when, you, when, you ice your, when, you, when the pitcher ices his arm after the game. It's, now. it's somewhat similar, but it's better because this is like a whole body a whole body ice down. So then, do people do this for a couple? How do you like do it for two weeks and then take a break? How does it work? No, some people do it. You know, do it every day, three to five times a week. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. The more you do it, the more you, the benefits. Wow. You get. Okay. Yeah. Twice but, a day. So, oh Al, yeah, you can do it. You gonna sign up? Get a this weekly. Is, this is it. Yeah. You checking know. out your abs? No, I was just like because I had the white. Um, That's what like kind of threw me because he started frosting. Up. Yeah, yeah. She was like, "Your chest hair is frosting up." It's like, for once at least, it's actually He's frost. White. You're turning white on me now. Threw me. So you know what your chest hair is going to look like when you're 75. Yeah. Exactly. It was like okay. my dad. Yeah. Well, thanks very much. I think we're going to get back in the car, guys. Uh, okay. Head, head back once again. It's the cryotherapy recovery chamber here at True Fitness. We had a great time. Love yes, this thank place. Thank you, this ladies. Is awesome. Yeah, thank you, guys. And they they have to get back in their clothes. Oh, it's come on. All right, and, you guys get dressed and head on back here. Tom and his moves. Uh, yeah. Two egg McMuffins and a sausage burrito. <laughs> yeah. We're going to. Uh, we can we're going stop to take if you break. want. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll be back and we'll be back in the car in a second. Okay. We'll take a break. This is. We're doing all the hard heavy lifting. Yeah, no, I liked it. It was uh, like it took all the tension out of my back. Way to go! So that I had, yeah, it was good. Would you like to have another one? Not today. But would you want me to put you on the on the to get another one? Sure. Okay. Hey, Elizabeth, let's give it. Let's give him another one. We'll give you guys. You, you want to try it sometime? We'll just put you on the. Well, uh, try. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Why not? I'll give it a try. Yeah. yeah. Maybe. 